Hello quilters. I want to introduce you to some brand new fabric and a wonderful new quilt block. Let's quilt a little bit different. Flower Pot is a wonderful new line from Island Batik. It's a signature line from my friend Jennifer at The Inquiring Quilter. And I just love all the fun floral prints and these saturated jewel tones. Time to make the 100% fun block from the Little Bit Different collection. Step one is to make the half square triangles that you need for the 100% fun block. And we're gonna start with the two colors or one color, depending on how you want to make this block. I always like the more colors, the better. So I've chosen two colors for the diagonal of the block and I'm gonna pair each of these with the background fabric. So once I have sewn my two at a time half square triangles, I am going to grab my rotating mat and my block lock ruler. And I can use those tools to trim your half square triangles apart and then I need to iron. And then I'm going to use my block lock seam guide there for the actual trimming step. And then I can spin that rotating mat around, keep my, keep my block in place and trim. And we will continue working on our stack of half square triangles and then be ready for step two. Two versions of this block. So we start with our half square triangles and we need to rotate them so that they form the diagonal of the block. So I've got my two colors going there and I am pairing the dark fabric with the downhill version and you see I've got that triangle rotated the wrong way so I've got my downhill and my dark blocks in the corner so then the opposite is going to be my uphill block and this time I'm putting the plain fabrics the accent colors the lighter one in the corners and again, I am lining these half square triangles up so that they form that diagonal. So there I have the two blocks that make the chevron in this pattern. If I separate those a little more, you can see how they will come together to form the downhill diagonal and the uphill. The other thing to notice, I always look for the patterns in my layout so I can uh, keep things in mind with the fabric placement. These half square triangles are the same orientation for the fabric. So my orange flowers are in the top right, top right. My uh, pink accent color is in the bottom left, bottom left. So when you're laying out the block, you can kind of keep things matched up that way as well. But this is looking so bright and cheerful. I can't wait to get it all sewn together. With equal numbers of uphill and downhill blocks, you can start your quilt layout. Do you prefer to sew blocks together in rows? Or do you like the twosie foursie method. I prefer less seams to match, so I'm gonna make my four patches and join those together. And then to bring these quilts up to a decent size, the six by nine inch blocks can be a little bit tricky. So I just add several borders and finish a nice lap size quilt. 
If you want to see where the Little Bit Different collection started, check out this video next.